एंड वेलकम टू मथुराज रेसिपी डॉट कॉम टूडे आई एम मेकिंग बनाना शिरा और प्रसादा शिरा दिस इज अ सेमोलिना डेजर्ट प्रिपेर्ड ऑन ऑस्पिशियस अकेजन स्पेशली वेन एवर वी हैव सत्यनारायण पूजा एट होम इट ऑल्सो गोज परफेक्ट एज अ ब्रेकफास्ट रेसिपी सेल इट स्टार्ट दिस प्रसादा शिरा इज ऑफन प्रिपेर्ड बाय यूजिंग इक्वल प्रपोर्शन्स ऑफ शुगर घी एंड सेमोलिना बट जस्ट टू कट डाउन ऑन कैलरीज हियर आई एम यूजिंग लिटिल लेसर अमाउंट ऑफ घी For half a cup of suji, I am using quarter cup or fourth cup of ghee. And here I have quarter cup of melted ghee. In here goes half cup of suji. And fine variety of suji goes perfect for the shira. Mix this through. And I will continue to dry roast this suji over medium high heat until it gets good, nice golden color. and by the time this suji gets ready we will make our banana and nuts ready to go in the shira and for this here skillet is heating up with 1 tablespoon of ghee in that goes in some cashew nuts and almonds you can choose the nuts of your choice and roast them a little bit until they get light golden color good they has started to change its color Next, I will add some golden raisins and let them puff up a bit. And next, I will add some sliced banana. And here I have used one nice sized banana which was very good ripe. Put that in. Mix this through. and let this banana get caramelized little bit this doesn't take very long time it will be get ready in just about 2 to 3 minutes and also i am making sure to roast this suji in between and it's been cooking for 2 minutes now turn off the heat this banana looks good it's been caramelized really good i don't like my banana to get completely mashed up I like to have nice caramelized bites of this banana in shira so I generally don't like to cook this all the way through well here suji looks good it has got good golden color it's a time to put in some milk and i'm adding hot milk so lower down the heat a little bit so that this mixture won't bubble up when we pour in milk add milk slowly put the lid on and before we add sugar let this suji or semolina gets cooked for 3 more minutes and after about 3 minutes let's put in some sugar give this a mix and after sugar gets mixed in next we'll add this nuts and banana mixture also here i have few tulsi leaves put that also mix this in and finally put in little bit of cardamom powder and mix this everything together and now continue to cook this covered over medium heat for about 4 to 5 minutes so that all the flavors from banana tulsi leaf cardamom will get absorbed in this suji well here this shira is cooked over medium heat for 5 minutes now looks good it's smelling fabulous i love this combination of banana with shira and this tulsi leaf add wonderful flavor and aroma in this shira and this prasada cha shira is one of my all time favorite recipe in this world 
it really tastes awesome the list of ingredients and text version of this recipe is available on my website madhurajrecipe.com developing a new taste see you soon bye bye